Today I'm going to demonstrate how to make this lovely um, amber set. Um, the ambers are drilled diagonally through back through to the front, so they're quite tricky to um, to keep them in in line. Um, so we're just going to thread them onto um, a head a long head pin, and it's the same method for the earrings as it is for the necklace. So we're threading on six of our ambers and they're diagonally drilled back from back to the front, which is very unusual. So we're threading on six. And the trick with this shape is to try and keep them as tight as possible to each other. Otherwise they will want to spin round, which is not what we want. So I'm keeping them all nice and tightly bunched together. Like so. And keeping them nice and tight together, I want to do a wrapped loop. And when you've done your wrapped loop, you need to wrap it around the head pin so that it goes as tight as possible to the ambers to stop them from spinning. So we'll just go round again. Like so. And then we need to snip off the end. Whoops. nice and close to the head pin. And then once you've done that, you will either add a jump ring to the pendant, oh, just need to open that up a little bit more. So you'll add that onto there, and then you can pop it onto the chain. Or if you want the earrings, you would obviously put them onto shepherd hook findings. And you can see from the finished jewellery, it creates a very nice, nice pendant and earring set with this very unusual strand.